In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can make an epic shirt just like what I'm wearing right now for free without premium. And this tutorial will be super fast and easy to follow along. So if you're a complete noob and don't know anything about making a shirt, trust me, you'll be a professional by the end of this video. So make sure to stick around. Also, I have a challenge for you. I bet you can't hit the like button on this video with only using your pinky. Honestly, I don't think you can do it. Anyway, let's get straight into the video. So the first thing that you want to do to make your scrum deli shirt is you want to go to create and I'll take you to this page right here and if you don't see this page and you're on another screen that looks like this then the fix to that is you need to have Roblox Studio downloaded so anyways what you want to go ahead and do is go down to shirts and once you press on it it will bring you to this page right here and the first thing that you're gonna need is you want to press on this link right here so that you can get the template for your shirt so you just want to right click on it and press save image as and once you have it saved you want to go to a website called photo P I'll have it linked in the description down below and just go ahead and press open from computer and get the template and once you select it it will be loaded into the software and if you guys don't know what photo p is it's basically an online version of photoshop and trust me it's totally safe and i've used it many many times before so next what you want to do is you want to press on this magnifying tool right here so that you can have it a bit more zoomed in and the next thing you want to do is go back to the left side of your screen and select the second tool which is the rectangle select and what you want to do is you want to get to the very corner of your shirts and you want to drag the cursor all the way to the other side and once you have that selected you can press the delete key on your keyboard and that will make that PNG and you just want to do it with all of these right here so I'm just gonna go ahead and do that real quick once you have your shirt fully PNG would looking something like this what you want to go ahead and do if you're just looking for something basic I would go ahead and look up the color you want your shirt to be my channel's color is cyan so I'm gonna pick a cyan color but you can pick whatever you want and once you got your color you can just right click on it and save image as once you got your color, you can press file, you can press open in place, and go ahead and select. And once you have it into your program, you just want to go ahead and resize it. And as you can see, the color is over the actual template. And what you want to do is just take your color and drag it under the template layer. And as you can see now, the shirt is now your desired color. And as you can see, there's some little imperfections here. And if you want to get rid of those, make sure the template layer is selected. And then go to your rectangle tool, and you could just go ahead and cut those out very easily. Once you get your shirt looking all nice and scrum diddly what i would recommend doing is making some hand holes for your character and to do that you want to make sure your color layer is selected what i would do is go about right here and drag this rectangle tool all the way up and you think that you should just press delete but we just need to press something real quick and you just want to go down and press this button right here and as you can see, it will make this bottom part PNG and keep everything else we selected. And anything that's PNG will make the skin show on your character. Now it's time to get into the fun stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and make a shirt that says subscribe on it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and press file. Then I'm going to press open in place and then go ahead and find my subscribe button. But if you want to put something else in, just go ahead and put whatever you want in there. So I'm just going to position this exactly how I want it. And then once you're done, you can press this check mark and I'll have it in the right position for you. I'm also going to add this cursor right here just to make it a little bit more professional. Then you can just press the check again. And as you can see, that already looks really good. You can also add whatever you want to the back, to the arms or whatever you want. But I'm just going to go ahead and leave this for now. But I think this looks good and this is what I'm going to use for my shirt. So what you want to do to save your shirt template is go to file press export and then press png and then just go ahead and press save and it'll go ahead and download for you and now what you want to go ahead and do is go back to the develop page go ahead and press choose file and then select the template and make sure to change your shirt name and as you can see it costs 10 robux to upload but there's a super simple way to get a quick few robux for free so if you want to get some quick robux fast go sign up for a microsoft rewards account and do all of these tasks Asks. You might need to do them for a bit, but you'll definitely get enough points to get 100 Robux or more. And for 100 Robux, you can upload 10 shirts if you want to. So it's more than enough. And then once you get enough points, go to redeem, type in Roblox, and then this will come up. You just go ahead and press on it. And for 100 Roblox, it only costs 150 points, which is not that much. And you can get this super, super fast. And if you want to know how to get these free Robux super, super fast, I'll have a video linked in the description down below and at the end screen of this video so that you can find the best way to get the most Robux really fast. Anyways, once you get your Robux into your account, you can just go ahead and press upload shirt for 10 Robux. And then you just want to go ahead and press confirm. And as you can see, 
it is uploaded and if we click on it as you can see it's not loading right now that's because it takes around 30 minutes to a couple hours for roblox to review the shirt just to make sure it doesn't have anything sus on it if you get what i mean but in the meantime you can go ahead and favorite the shirt and you can go ahead and press on these three dots right here then go ahead and press configure and you can go ahead and edit the description you can also set the item for sale so as soon as the shirt gets approved you can start making some sweet robux so if you want to set it for sale just go ahead and press this right here and you can go ahead and set the price for whatever you want but just remember roblox takes 30 percent so just go ahead and set your price accordingly i'm only going to set it for 10 robux and you can just go ahead and press save. And as you can see guys, the shirt is finally uploaded. And as you can see, it looks pretty nice, honestly. Let me just go ahead and equip it on my avatar. Sheesh, I look clean. And if you wanna buy the shirt, I'll have it linked in the description down below if you want to support me a little bit and this is the shirt in game as well looking pretty sweet so that was how to make your own shirt on roblox and if you want to figure out how to get that free robux so you can upload these shirts for free go ahead and click on this video right here and it'll take you straight to it 